Hello and welcome to the Sons of Thule. Today we are going to do the quest, remove the head and the disease will die. Hot starts here with Apothecary Cadmail and we're going to go ahead and start talking to him. So we kind of go through the same text as we did in the previous ones and then uh, see so he's out of ideas, the vile temple and we say we'll storm it again, but he's going to give us a secondary quest. We're going to take that one. Go ahead and accept that. And he will send us to the temple. Uh, so this is, you know, same thing. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to go in and we are going to kill uh, the scum lord. Here's a little pretense for that. Killing the Archpriest of Batoxilus certainly helps reduce the danger to the people of Ocean Green Village and to the forces of Atonius Bale. But you know that there is another power beyond that of the Archpriest, the one called Scum Lord, appears to be the one in charge. You have been asked to find him and cleanse him from Norath. It seems that this Scum Lord is in the temple. Seek him out. All right, so what we're going to do, I'm going to click ready, get everybody in, and uh, go from there. All right, everybody is down here. So the Scum Lord, um, no idea where he spawns. So let's take a look over here at tracking. Get that going. And this elevator just automatically goes up and down. All right. Da, 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 da. I don't even see him on tracking yet. So let's just uh, go around, start killing stuff. And uh, I'm sure he will find a way to show us. I don't think he spawns down in the south area. I don't think any of these quests kind of take place down there so I'm just gonna pull back a little bit and there we go did some rebuffing in between all the other ones I've made so hopefully uh, this works out pretty well for us and AOE on that guy perfection so it's kind of like kill the exact same mobs, I guess, as we did before. Uh, we're just going to have to kill more of them, I guess, until we find this guy. Uh, I don't know where that guy just came from. Um, he must be a roamer that comes and roams around here. I guess there are two roamers that come around on these side corn doors here. Right, let's grab this one. There comes the other one. Right down the hall, right over there. So we have to be ready for her. Everybody should be fine though. This is a uh, relatively easy uh, mobs, honestly. Uh, considering the, the buffs we have, that is one thing to consider. We are, uh, we are buffed, uh, but we also have decent gear. Uh, we're getting close to having all of the Paragon gear for sure. All right, let's kind of poke our head up here. Looks about normal. Let's go over this way. Clear, kind of clear that room last. All right, let's get her. Somehow she got stunned. I don't know what stunned her. I guess I, uh, my auto attack bash stunned her or something. All right, that is a dead end. Let's go this way. All right, let's get this guy. I'm not 100% sure. We just got to find him. So I think he, he's uh, somewhere in here. I think he's this way, honestly. And, uh... I know that because I'm kind of looking at the Alakazam. I think he's locked in this room here. And then there's a, uh, over in that area where the doctor spawns, or over here, uh, there could be a chance to spawn a named that will drop loot. Uh, we didn't get any loot last mission, uh, which is unfortunate, but hopefully get lucky on this next one that we're doing right now. dead 
and I think one of these is the placeholder for uh, the other named that could spawn in this room, the uh, High Priest. I've seen him spawn back here. So. Alright, well, that's... My bard was not with us the entire time. So let's see if we can fix that real quick. All right, there we go. And if it stops spinning. All right, I guess he's not in this room. Where is the other locked door? <laughs> Keep looking. All right, let's go maybe down here. That right, same guys in there as before. I'm not even gonna bother clearing those right now. Let's go up here and check. I can't imagine he's in that little room. That would be kind of... I don't even think that was a real room, was it? There we go. Let's do an AoE taunt. Got him. Let's walk to this one for a second. Maybe it's the hidden door. Ah, uh, that's the only other door I can think of in here. So if I click on that, right? Nope, that opened it up just fine. Alright, I guess we're on an adventure. <laughs> Get to figure out where this guy's at. Uh, there's another one over here. I guess she just ran off. I've been pretty lazy about snaring, uh, since that's where I have my, uh, come on, why are you not following? It's where I have my, uh, what you call it, my macro dad for, uh, uh, the, the shaman. So whenever I hit four to snare, he does a, uh, Puma and, uh, Whatever the other one is, Puma and uh, the Slow Proc, which is nice. Uh, the Slow proc, proc is pretty good. Not sure why that popped up, I guess. Never. <laughs> I hate how they always shift after it shows it. Alright, I guess there's nothing in this room. Uh, we didn't get the named either. Uh, it's supposed to be here. It's like a putrid assassin, I believe. We are in an instance, right? Yeah. There we go. Got him. And uh, I don't know when this video will air. Uh, chronologically, hopefully I can <laughs> edit it before, uh, before the next stream. But... Case that does not happen, and this airs after the fact. Uh, I'm thinking about turning this one, this series, into just a YouTube series, and then when the TLP comes out, switching the stream to being a TLP character. Uh, it's a true box server, so it would just be probably one character, maybe two. Uh, I'm trying to decide on what to play. I was thinking like uh, a monk plus a shaman or a shadow knight and a shaman or uh, something th like that. Uh, I'm not 100% sure. I guess I did all that without the bard. Uh, but trying to th really think about it, uh, I know uh, a lot of people wanted to get together on the TLP and kind of like I, I got I got left behind right uh, everybody I was grouping with is already in their 90s and uh, you know I don't want them waiting around for me right I'm uh, been going pretty slow at this 
because I'm 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 level locking myself. I'm doing AAs uh, manually, so it's gonna take a lot longer for me to uh, to catch up to level 90, right? Because I'm gonna have to get AAs at 85. I'm gonna have to get AAs at you know every little gap in there. And so that's going to take a little longer. Like right now I'm doing, uh, I'll do a Gribbles mission or something. And when I, when I don't have time to make a video, I'll just run and do that real fast. And you know, that works for me, right? Like I can get that done. I don't need it. I don't need to record every, every time I run Gribbles, right? <laughs> uh, so that, you know, that works out for my schedule. But, uh, you know, on a TOP, right? Especially the new one that's coming up. It's a standard unlock, right? So you can get to 50. Uh, you got four, I think four weeks to get to 50, and then after that, eight weeks to get to, uh, uh, <laughs> 60, jeez. And then that'll be, uh, that'll, um, that'll go from, uh, Kunark to Velos, or uh, Velio, Velios, or however I'm saying it wrong, I've been corrected multiple times, uh, but I always forget, uh, so... Those are eight week unlocks, and then uh, it seems it seems like that would be a pretty nice uh, little little thing, right? We can do on stream. That'd be like two. Maybe I'll do three. Move back to three nights a week. Maybe do a Thursday instead. I, Monday Monday Wednesday was just too uh, too intense for me. The uh, uh, Saturday Monday. Uh, Whatever, it's just killing me, and I was, you know, trying to spend a little bit more time with the kids today. Uh, summer's starting, they didn't just, like, want to do their own thing. Uh, they don't want to hang out at all, so... I'm probably, I mean, I'm thinking about it. Maybe I had back that other day. I'm gonna... I still have to do a lot of thinking on that. But I'm trying to think. I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't play more than two characters. Uh, I would prefer, like... Maybe like Necromancer Shaman? That would be kind of fun. I don't think I've done th that duo. I was thinking uh, Paladin, but uh, Ion's going to play Paladin Bard. And, uh, to, you know, making grouping together would be kind of... Since he's going to tank and CC, I don't really want to... <laughs> I, don't, I don't really want to do everything. Uh, Shadow Knight, like if I did Ogre Shaman. Uh, Ogre... Uh, what you call it? That would be kind of a, a fun little combo. I don't know. There's a door somewhere around here. There it is. And, uh, you know, I don't know. So trying to figure that out would be fun. Is this the door he's hidden behind? No, oh, it's just an invisible wall. <laughs> okay. All right. Um,. Maybe he's down here in that one. Oh my gosh, that would be hilarious. Let's do that. Throw all the uh, bugs. That's not the right way. But yeah, so if, if anybody is uh, has thoughts on playing on the TLP server, please let me know. And like, you know, what kind of classes you want to play? Uh, because obviously we will, we'll probably make a guild, right? Oh, there was dwarves right there the whole time. Uh, all right. So that door is locked. She is stuck there. All right, so that is where he's at. We need to find a name. This guy right, right here is the guy. He's behind and to the right. So let's go back up here and see if we can find him. Head to the left. So maybe he spawned over here. We already cleared everything, so that makes it a little easier. Straight ahead. So maybe he spawned back here. There he is, right there. Is everybody in the room? All right. There we go. But, I, you know, I don't know. I, it's the TLP seems kind of interesting, like it's a standard one. Uh, I, I would prefer like the free trade, but it does get rid of the uh, the boxing stuff. 
like the true box stuff, it does get rid of that, which is nice, right? I, I like to box. I think this game is uh, meant to box, right? Uh, I'm 100% in favor of boxing. I'm against automation and anything like that. It can't be done through uh, you know, manual play, right? So I feel like once they get rid of that, it'll be nice. Aaron, where did my key go? Oh, I didn't loot the key, did I? There you go. I don't have auto loot on. No, I don't want to drop it on the ground. What? Oh, a larger key. All right. All right, we have to find another piece of the key. Comes from another guy, Proctor. This guy right here. All right, so I guess we should have clicked that door originally when we first zoned in and we would have saved some backtracking that we're doing right now. But at the same time, We've already backtracked and killed everything, so we can just kill this guy right now. So there's a few guys locked up over there we didn't kill. Easy enough. Got the other key. Send that to me. Alright, now we can open the door. And go get the scum lord. Oh, jeez. That is the wrong turn. Um, but... Yeah, so TLP possibility, make that the stream that we do instead of uh, a set of these guys. And then I can spend, you know, the more time that I've been doing uh, with these last few missions uh, where I'm uh, reading everything, you know, it's kind of a little bit more enjoyable for me uh, when I'm actually uh, can take the time to read everything and uh, do that, you know, it's... Uh, it is actually, uh, I like the quest and the lore, and it, it it's hard to take that kind of in, stuff in when you're streaming it, right? It's, uh, I don't know how to say it. It's just like, I'm more focused on like looking at chat and making sure all that stuff's going, right? And at least with a TLP server, right? Four weeks of classic, that's, you know, I don't, you know, you don't even have to pay attention to classic. I can just, I, I can just AFK pretty much and kill stuff. So, depending on the class, right? So, it gives it makes it a little bit easier to, you know, stream that stuff. And I think we can get, you know, a lot of people together for that kind of stuff. I know TLPs are kind of, you know, what what's more popular? Uh, Throne of Eye is my favorite server by far, but uh, I think. Uh, if we could you know get a get a little guild going and uh go do some of these raids and stuff while they're in level and stuff like that i think that'd be fantastic so i just don't know what to play i can i can do two characters uh and that's probably what i'll do i just i'm just gonna move my editing box over to where uh i play normally and just do it from there right, let's kill this guy there we go i'm gonna slow him i probably need to here I'm just each touch and he's dead now he's gonna run away like a baby there we go and we are done so we need to get out of here and head back to the apothecary which means running through uh the other zone so let me get back there and we'll turn this in all right we're back here at the apothecary let's go inhale him and there we go and what do we get here we get uh currency and a fragment pretty good awesome okay so that's done and we are done with this quest so next episode is going to be uh the bub bubble Bubonians? Bubonians are coming? 
Ah, uh, that's going to be the next one. And it looks like it's a mini raid. So we'll see how this goes. We might be able to do it. We might not be able to. <laughs> so we'll try it and see. And uh, see where this goes. But uh, thank you very much for watching. And hope you have a fantastic day.